Yeah, I get it. Okay. Yeah. Yo, so back to the um. So you, you embrace it, the attention, right? Yeah. Or, or it, it don't matter. As long as it bring the dollars, I love it. But where? When is it too far? Never. So not too long ago, we seen the situation with Sukiyana. Mm-hmm. Right, and we seen how why like she pre- we can't ignore that she present herself in a way. Right. No matter if that's who she really are or really is or not, right? right. She present herself in a way. And that could be her persona, right? right? That's respectable. That's what she is. But somebody, right, down the line with YK, YK or Cyrus took it too far. Right. You say that it's never too far. But, I mean, that's clearly. I mean, because I don't feel like that was upon attention. I feel like for him it was attention, for, but for her it's not. So it's like, mm, how can I say this? I don't feel like she expected that. Like, you know, even sitting in that spot, I twerk all the time. Right. You know, I do what I do in my space. So I just feel like at the end of the day, you a man. Would you want somebody to do that to your daughter? I could talk about goddamn fucking in the middle of the flow, fucking in the middle of the street, doing whatever I do. But that doesn't invite you into my space. Mm. Yeah. Like, I could talk about whatever I talk about that doesn't invite you in my space. You shouldn't touch no woman. Like, that's that's like you a kid. Like, you in school, like, oh, my God, I'm a kid. Like, oh, she look good. I'm a kid. Let me got them. I'm a kid. That's that's kid thinking. But man thinking, would you ever do that? Would I ever do that? Like, not, I mean, not saying outside of you being no, engaged. No, I I'm have saying, a conversation. I could have a conversation. Right, I'm saying as a man, though, a man is never doing that because he knows your parameters. Like, she could talk about whatever. She could be f***ing on the net. That doesn't give you, oh, let me just, like, nah. You got to respect. Respect goes a long way, and that goes from yourself with your mother. Like, which way? Oh, yeah, your right one. Thank you, MJ. Great catch, man. You had to try and reach through the camera. Because she's a woman. She knows the vibes. Yeah, I, I wasn't looking, so I didn't. My bad. Yeah, uh, what I was saying. Um, No, nah, I mean, you're right. Well, and, how, long, how long was it showing for? Was her nipple showing? I thought the bottom. I saw. The nipple or was mm. How bad is it? Because I don't, I don't really. It wasn't bad, I don't yeah. think. When I seen. If it's not like a. Uh... Yeah, no, I got you. <laughs> So yeah, uh um Yeah, so I just feel like he was totally out of line because it doesn't really matter what she talk about. She could talk about anything. Like I'm just saying, like grabbing somebody's face, like I get it. You say what you say in the records, I say it. I talk crazy, like because that's what I want in the bedroom. Mm. Maybe I'm talking about an experience. Like, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not saying I'm in the middle of a basketball game, grab my face and kiss me. You totally out of line. What are you doing? Mm. I didn't give you that signal. I don't care what I talk about. No, nah, that makes sense. And you spoke. That's just like me saying Chris Brown got dick prints, and I walk up to him and try to grab his dick. That's like the same thing. That's like the same thing. That's that's like disrespectful. Like that's like the same thing. Yeah. yeah. I mean, like, cause we got hella that come up, and and you know, y'all show y'all in the boxes, or y'all might got OnlyFans, and a woman would never grow up to you and be like, "Let me grope you." Like, I mean, I don't know. I didn't have some. No, you crazy. What you think these girls? I said are- a woman. I didn't say a girl. I didn't say a female. I said a woman. So I ain't speaking on. Yeah, and a man species. would never do that. I'm not saying speaking on other species. Why? Cause why? K. Osiris is a boy. Okay. And so I think. I mean, I think that's a good conversation in itself, though. I feel like because that does, that's not the only thing to, to determine if we boys or men or not, or yes, girls or women. That's not the only. That's thing. your thinking. It boils down to your thinking. It boils down to your thinking. It does. Re- regardless of you admit it or not, it boils down to your thinking. I mean, I feel like it, it boils down to the people you're around. It boils down to the environment. Your experiences, your experiences right? Right. And like outside of that, right? Because that's just a touchy topic. So outside of that situation, I feel like there's a lot of things that we go through as black individuals. Since we're here having this fucking serious conversation, I won't have it. But as black men and black women, right? There's right. a lot of things that we like coming up because. We only got one parent. Some some of us don't have any parents. Right. There's a lot of things that I grew we up from the grimy, so I understand. Right. Right. So there's a lot of things we got to learn as adults. Right. right. It's not boy or gr- boy or girl, man or woman. There's a lot of things that we learn as adults, and there's a lot of adults out here who becoming grown, right? Becoming women, becoming men, right? right. That's an extreme part of it. But we when we I, when we look outside of that, it's hard to say we to judge somebody by their actions and say if they a boy or, or girl or not because it's like, bro, we all learning at our different paces. I get it, but it's like 
you've been in this industry for so long. Like, you know what I'm saying? You have a child. And I just feel as though certain things are just off the table. No, outside of that, If though, he grabbed her butt, it would be different. No, it wouldn't. Outside of that, because, like, I can't, like, I'm not about to be excusing that. That's weird, right? Yeah, that's but weird. But at the same time, I can understand a, a, a boy not having no direction and need right. to be taught. Right? Yeah, I agree. That's why I, I understand. Like, I, a lot of people ain't liking, I hope, damn, I, I hope I don't get canceled for this, but when Meek was like, bro, that just needs his ass whooped. I agree with that. I did too. He probably I never agree, learned. I agree with that too because, I mean, for one, like, I didn't grow with my mom. Like, you know what I'm saying? My mom was on drugs for a long part of my time. I grew up with my dad in the house. I grew up with my grandma. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, grew up with, when I was in school, motherfuckers didn't even know what I was going through at home. Like, I'm talking about we had nothing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, lights off, boiling water, the shower. Like I, I grew up to that, so I can understand that, and I can understand making a living for myself. Mm. So I understand both sides. But at the end of the day, you have accountability. Fact. You know what I'm saying? When you grow up and you know what's right and what's wrong, because when you do something wrong, you feel it in your soul. Yeah, because you can lie to yourself, mm. but when you know what's wrong, but God put that in everybody, you, you know. can feel it. Fact. Right. So when you do wrong, if you decide to say, "Oh, okay." I excuse this behavior. Everybody patting you. I excuse this behavior. And not just speaking on him, when you at a certain plateau, they gonna excuse a lot of shit. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? It, a lot a of people. Of money, they gonna excuse a it's lot of a shit. yes man going on, and that's the problem. It's a lot of no direction going on. That's the problem. Especially with men, especially with women. I can say it both ways. Like, I do what I do, but I'm marketing in a certain way. If you really, that's the surface. Like, if you go to the music, it's really like that. It's really speaking on life story. It's speaking on love. It's speaking on. Club, but we we got like different like it's different it's different levels to it. Mm. So you know you just gotta 